Okay, referring to this figure, suppose AD1, which I'll go ahead and circle, and uh, SRAS1 indicate the initial conditions in the goods and services market. Now, in the short run, which of the following will most likely result from an unexpected shift to a more expansionary monetary policy? Well, the first thing right off the bat that's likely to happen is that aggregate demand will shift to the right. And, of course, A is saying just that, an increase in aggregate demand from 81 to 82. So let's put a check mark by that. B says a decrease in short-run aggregate supply from SRAS1 to SRAS2. It's not clear why that would happen at all. If it's an expansionary monetary policy, uh, there isn't any reason to believe that this is going to cause a run-up in resource prices, which is something that would cause just such an effect. So we can safely cross that from the list. C says both an increase in aggregate demand from 81 to 82 and a decrease in short-run aggregate supply from SRAS1 to SRAS2. But we've already eliminated that as a possibility. So C is out as well. And then lastly, we are left with D. No change. AD and SRAS will not shift. But we've just indicated that an unexpected expansionary monetary policy will surely affect aggregate demand and favorably push it to the right.